I think it comes, it comes together initially just meeting with the executive and the school staff and talking about a way in which we can bring their mission and vision alive. I was so thrilled because I was part of the process of, of uh, with the children writing the song. With John Bellin to be able to change the melody and also um, some of the words we put in and incorporated as well as taking the ethos um, in our school logo. But then we take it to the next stage where we gather with the children because it's really important that the words and uh, a lot of the song content comes from the children. I just thought of words that kind of like reminded us of our school. We gave him suggestions on what our school is like and how we feel the school should be represented in our song. Uh, and then we also helped put the words together, so it wasn't just him, it was more the children doing it. Like, just, like, maybe suggesting something about, like, that we should add. They came up with those words, they feel very comfortable, they're very happy being part of the community. They feel safe, they feel loved, and I think that that's very important for us. So, when you listen to the words, they're a beautiful reflection of our school community. And so from that process, we have uh, a series of words. And then I offer the children a couple of different tunes that we could possibly use. Um, and they really develop an understanding, both the theoretical background of music and also the practical application of it as well. I learned that there's more than, that there's more than one take. I always thought that, uh, that those usually would only be one take and then you just do it again while I didn't realise that you could layer it. Music is like making a cake. It's got lots of ingredients. Um, I think because we do a lot of like really different songs and some are more like calming and then some are like really strong and I think it's really fun to do all the different sounds. The research tells us that music is, is integral to, to learning. It really reaches children on many different le levels of learning, uh, learning modes. So it's, it's also a wonderful way, I think, and one of our students mentioned it just recently, of being calming, because we all live in such a busy world, and music just takes us to another place, it enables us to connect. I think children learn so much through music, and I'm really thrilled to think that there are opportunities now through Sydney Catholic Schools to offer more music to our students to help them in their learning, to help their well-being, to help their faith. Music allows them to express themselves uh, as well as you know, experience something different in their day. And I think mixing up their day really helps them to um, you know, be able to explain themselves emotionally. What is St Paul of the Cross? We've got the song now and singing is a wonderful way of communicating. We sing it as a prayer. It's a prayer to our community. So I'm very excited to introduce it and see the reaction from the, the students and the parents and teachers of course. I love music. <laughs>